energy vibration reading for all sun, moon, and rising sun. Okay. Um, uh, this is uh, for the Aquarians. And uh, thank you. Thank you for everything. Thank you for your likes and share. Thank you for the wonderful new experience. Uh, thank you for being with me on this journey. I want to say to each and every person, it's going to be a week. It's going to be a strange week. It is the week of strength. But your strength is going to be good because the sign of uh, the star is in the middle. So a lot of stuff is going to be happening. The star, um, the chariot is here, and the wheel of fortune. So good things is going to happen. So this is going to be a wonderful time for you because what will be happening is that the energy of the star with the um, clarity, the sword on Thursday, and yet still you have the wheel of fortune which is wonderful this is just a wonderful energy vibration the energy of this week this week begin from the 8th until the 14th of May and it's going to be wonderful because in the third week wonderful new blessings are going to come in because your sister sign will be going in the vibration as we look at your week we have the energy vibration of the organization um, the Emperor is an earth energy vibration, so it's bringing balance to certain aspect that was in a situation. And what is happening is that there is a situation um, that is going on. And this situation is um, um, with an organization, so some people will have it with your work, some people will have it with um, for insurance, some people will have it with a hospital, some people have it with so many different sort of organization and groups of people. And what is happening is that this situation is is um, a bit of a negative energy that is coming from this situation. But what is happening on Tuesday is that you are going to change the energy vibration because you have the Ten of Swords. So what's going to happen is that you are going to change your energy vibration. You are going to understand what is really happening around you and this by understanding this ten of swords and you're going to change this ten of swords and removing them from you and on wednesday you're going to understand that the energy vibration is the star you have overcome something you have walked away from something you are seeing something that was plain that was not right and you remove yourself from this and you become really the star of something because you show yourself and you accept and you see that something was unjust and you have stand up against it and the star, the energy vibration of the star comes out. As we move on and we go forward on Thursday, another good day for you. So Tuesday and Thursday is a good day for you. You have the energy vibration of the two of swords and you're now seeing things clearly. So exactly what you were seeing and what you felt from an organization um, you walked away and you see um, what was happening and now you're seeing things clearly and this is good sometimes things happen to you and um, sometimes things happen to you and you wonder why these sort of things happen and sometimes you 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 know jobs and that sort of a thing and certain things come to an end and you wonder why and it's because um, Sometimes the Wheel of Fortune is here to show you that what you were in was not a viable thing for you. And with the energy of the Wheel of Fortune being here, it is moving you and helping you to see how important that it was just a karma cycle. And um, the, the Wheel is coming in, bringing in good fortune, success, abundance, and love, happiness, and it bringing something to an end. So congratulations to you guys. Really, really, really congratulations. As we move forward, we see the energy vibration of the energy of uh, the chariot. The energy of the chariot on Saturday is going to be a wonderful energy. It is a time movement. Um, a lot of people will be moving about. Movement is happening. People will be thinking about moving. You'll be celebrating your victory and success to a situation that has happened in the week from Monday to Friday. It was a week of wonderful. So, I mean, for you guys, you have just wonderful situations that are happening to you. And you need to know and see and feel and focus certain aspect on certain aspects. So this is good. As we move on, we, on Saturday, we have the energy of the Three of Wands, which is Sunday. The Three of Wands, which is wonderful. I know, look at just the best things in the card. 
because some people really don't like the energy vibration of these cards. But I am working with them to overcome my fear. And so should you also connect and work with them to overcome your fear. Okay? So this is a wonderful week. The week is going to be very, very interesting um, for you guys. You have the energy vibration of the star. That is going to be your focus, the energy vibration of the star. It's going to be your focus in this week because what is happening is that certain aspect that is happening in this week is going to be extremely good. As I look at the energy in this in this week, um, you have the two, um, seven, the star energy is, um, um, so you will realize that the number one energy is going to be the vital focus of your week. The number one energy is going to be the vital focus of your week. And why this is going to happen, it's because of the situation that is happening around you. And this sort of a situation is um, when the, the number one energy is, is new beginning, new things are coming up, new understanding, new awareness, but yet still you'll be connecting at a, a, a higher energy vibration which is going to lead you to a wonderful place in your life, which is going to give you understanding um, to certain aspect of your life and be aware of how, how focal you are and how positive things will happen if you have positive thoughts and you expect positive things, then positive things will happen. It is going to be a week of wonderful um, energies that will be coming in, but yet still, if I look at your week, there is nothing as love. There is no love. And this week, it's going to be the energy of you trying to fight. Some people is going to be fighting against an injustice in an organization and you're going to win. And on the other hand, some people are going to see the injustice in organization and you are going to realize that uh, um, you need to move away from the situation. The Wheel of Fortune is going to come because uh, what is happening is that with an organization, you have overcome and win overcome a situation in organization and you have moved yourself away from that organization and it was a karmatic situation okay so it's it's the most of it have to do with the people who work and 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 the people who have business um the people who um work in organization you're going to be you're going to stand out because you have done something and you received the energy of the star and whenever we, because you have, the week is balanced with the first energy of the hair event, okay? Then you have the star, and then you have the wheel of fortune. This is just a wonderful, wonderful situation, okay? This is an extreme wonderful situation. So whatsoever is happening in this time, at this time, um, this is going to be extremely vital, to you at this time because of a um, situation that have been playing out, okay? Um, the, 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 the organization with people and groups of people, and there was something that has happened. You stand up for a certain sort of thing and a certain sort of injustice, and the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune comes out. So it was a karmatic situation for a lot of people, and for um, some people, you're um, your luck is going to start coming in now. Um, for some people, the end of a negative um, situation, a negative time um, that has been happening, uh, you have gone through negative energy, negative people around you. This situation has now come to an end. It was a karmatic situation. This situation from was from out um, other lifetimes, and um, it is now um, to come to an end which is extremely good because your luck is going to start flowing now and with your luck flowing you're going to move yourself away from this sort of energy as we look the energy vibration of the ten of swords that some of you got from out of an organization and this could be that you saw something that uh, um, was happening in the organization and you decide not to um, participate in this sort of a situation and then um, 
you you got stabbed in the back um, from a lot of people because of certain aspects and certain things you do not vibrate with that sort of energy you got stabbed in the back with um, certain things and then you become victorious and success because you walk away from this situation okay so the um, the ten of swords um, being stabbed in the back um, you are going to be victorious over this because um, what's to ever that was happening it was it was lying deceiving it was people lying deceiving and doing certain things they were really lying and deceiving and uh, um, they try to um, break you or let you fall but they all end up falling in their same pit and you are victorious and successful because you walk away from something that uh, you see wasn't and the, the chariot comes to take you away from that situation and move you to something much better in your life again I know for a lot of people when injustice happening in an organization and you need to um, move out and move away from this organization um, it's hard because you sit to focus and, and but look at always focus on you know what is my angels protecting me from every time that something like this that people um, vibrate with such a low energy vibration and they lie cheat and backstab you ask yourself what is the angel protecting me from because most of the time you know what the angels are protecting you from you see what the angels are protecting you from you have seen certain aspects and certain things that is in that vi um, energy vibration of that company or group of people and the angels are protecting you from that so whenever they work against you and they play against you and these things these things happen then you understand where you are as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the two of sword so of course clarity came in clarity came in to a lot of situation that has been happening clarity finally came came in to um, specific situation that has been happening clarity came in once and for all clarity came in and here we are at the end that it comes to an end of a cycle in your life and something wonderful and new and beginning because you can see down here this is the negative thing that you were in that you're going to come out and at the end of the day you will be here you'll be focusing on here so it's going to be extremely wonderful so I want to say to you um, you Aquarians out there um, sometimes things some certain things happen in your life and it's okay walk away move away accept it and take the higher ground and I'm saying namaste until next week